Hey, welcome to How It Happens. I'm John McQuilkin. Thanks for tuning in. First in the news, singer Amy Winehouse. She has canceled all her upcoming August tour dates due to exhaustion. But sources close to the singer say that she may be suffering from a chemical dependency. Oh, yes, yes, yes. But when asked if she's going into rehab, Amy said no, no, no. Next in the news, Brad Pitt and Angelina Jolie. There are reports coming in that they are splitting up. There is no truth to this rumor. They're getting along just fine. Now, as far as Angelina having an eating disorder, no truth to that either. Yeah, she has lost a lot of weight, but she says it's because she's chasing after four kids all day and the stress of trying to work and raise a family at the same time. So I don't think we need to worry about Brad Pitt or Angelina Jolie, but maybe we should worry about Britney Spears, huh? She's not doing too well, huh? Anyways, uh, reports are now coming in that Britney is going to be performing at the MTV Music Video Awards. That would be a disaster. But when contacted, the director of the awards said, if she's performing, that's news to him. So I think suffice to say she won't be there, thank heaven. Next in the news, folks, American Idol winner Jordan Sparks. She has just signed a deal with Jive Records, and she's going to release her first single called Tattoo on August 27th, and she hopes to compete and be as good as Kelly Clarkson, and we just wish her all the best. Next in the news, Lindsay Lohan. As you guys know, she is in rehab down at Cirque Lodge in Utah. Well, her father, Michael Lohan, has been speaking out lately because he, he's upset that they keep releasing her on these day trips. He thinks if you do rehab, you should be in rehab and not be left let out. Just the other day, she was seen riding her bicycle through Sundance, Utah, and the day before that, she was released to go. Where do you think she went? She went to a tanning salon, folks. Why do you need a tan in rehab? I have no idea. So Michael Lohan speaking out, he says, keep her locked up so that she can get the help that she needs. And he should know he's an ex-addict himself. Folks, next in the news, Sabre Johnson. She has won So You Think You Can Dance. She won $250,000 and she's been deemed America's best dancer. So we wish her all the best. Folks, on this day in history, back in 1977, comedic actor Groucho Marx passed away. And also on this day, back in 1977, a musical group with a lead singer named Gordon Sumner, otherwise known as Sting, gave their very first performance at a nightclub in Birmingham, England. In celebrity birthdays, we have uh, Robert Redford. He turned 71. Ed Norton, 38 years old today. Dennis Leary, 50 years old. Christian Slater, can you believe he's 38 years old? Patrick Swayze, remember him from Dirty Dancing? He turns 55 years old. And Roman Polanski turns 74 years old. And I am sure that they are all watching. So I just want to wish them all a great big old Hollywood Happens happy birthday. And shout outs, I want to do a shout out to Byron F. Garcia. You guys probably know who he is by now. He's that awesome Filipino uh, prison warden down in the Philippines. He uh, lets his prisoners uh, perform and dance to music and then he videotapes it and uploads it here on YouTube. So please check him out. His videos are so inspirational. That's Byron F. Garcia, B-Y-R-O-N, the letter F, G-A-R-C-I-A. -A. Check him out. You will not be sorry. And as I said before, I couldn't do a show like this without people like you, Byron. So thank you so much. Well, that's it for today's show. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did and you'd like to become a subscriber, it is so easy. And get this, it doesn't cost a dime. Do you see that orange button that says subscribe? Just click on it, and when you do, you'll get my videos as soon as I upload them. Hey, and if you like videos here on YouTube, it's real important that you rate the videos that you watch, and you do that by clicking on those stars. Well, that's it. I thank you for watching, and I thank YouTube for providing this forum that lets you watch. I'm gonna have another show real soon, I promise you that. So until then, take care, everybody, and I'll see you in Hollywood.